So, sir, you were a submarine officer by trade. You served as a, on a submarine as a SEAL and, and a Commodore. And you were also the recipient of the Stockdale Award. So, sir, how have your achievements and your career path, how has that uh, made you ready for, for uh, th this position? The, uh, I've had some tremendous opportunities in my career, and I've had the benefit of having had some amazing teachers. Uh, from uh, my, my first chief when I was a division officer all the way up to most recently Admiral Moran and a lot of great commanding officers and flag officers and, and first class petty officers along the way. I learned from everyone and I'll tell you my biggest takeaway is uh, you know respect is a two-way street. You, you respect folks up the chain of command. We talk about that a lot but I believe it, 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 it pays huge dividends when you show respect down the chain of command as well. And, uh, and that's sort of a form of humility. Humility and understanding that everyone can contribute regardless of their rank. Everyone has fresh ideas. That's a form of diversity. Fresh ideas regardless of the seniority. It brings value to the team. It makes a better team. Uh, but by showing that uh, up and down the chain of command, by working for your team, they will give back to you thousands of times over. Uh, this tour I'm particularly excited about because now I get to work for the team and uh, everything I do when I come into the morning I'm excited about going to work about what I can do to help our sailors each and every day. Awesome. Okay, so final question, what is your message to the fleet? Uh, I would uh, just ask the fleet to uh, understand that First of all, you've got a lot of folks working in the man manpower, personnel, training, and education enterprise that have your best interests in mind each and every day. We're working hard. Sometimes it can be, uh, it can be frustrating as you're reading uh, Navy Times and your local newspaper or blog sites about some of the, the battles that go on, but there are folks fighting hard day in and day out to get the, the best compensation, the best career choices, the best options that, that we can deliver. And I think uh, in, in the end, uh, the, the Navy is a great place to stay, and we are going to continue to get even better, and we look forward to seeing you out in the fleet. Awesome. Well, sir, that's all I have for you. Thank you for, for answering the questions. Thanks, Pastor Burleson. And again, con congratulations on, uh, on your position as CMP. Thank you. And thank you all for watching, and be sure to stay tuned for the latest news coming from Chief Naval Personal Office.